All right, let's do this. <laughs> I have wet hair. I don't have time to style before I film this video, guys, because my son needs a nap <laughs> and he's a cranky monster today. Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm Jessica Yick, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today I have another skincare first impressions video for you. And today we are going through the Farm RX. This is a brand new line uh, with Avon Canada. It was launched in Campaign 7. I got it about three-ish weeks ago. I just haven't had time to get this done. But anyways, this one here is actually the special trial kit. And I love the fact that Avon did this this time around because sometimes you get like the larger bottles, like the full size, and it's nice to get those. However, if you don't love a product, it's much easier to commit to, let's say, like a smaller trial size before purchasing the large size. So thank you Avon for doing that. First and foremost, this is exciting because this is a clean beauty vegan skincare line. Vegan beauty and clean beauty is definitely a, I don't even really want to say trending, but it's definitely, it's kind of trending for lack of better words, but it is a products that are really um, in the forefront of skincare and beauty right now. I apologize for the glare guys. I didn't even have to to set up my 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 thing is that better is that better for you it's really yellow though basically this trial pack and i want did want to show you the full size too this is the full size they are huge this is ginormous they are 90 ml but i wanted to show you the trial size first because this is a limited edition and it's only available to either campaign 9 or 10. So if you do want to get your hands on one of these, make sure you do click the link below or contact your local Avon representative to get your hands on one of these beauties. Going back to veganism and vegan beauty, it is part of the whole wellness movement. We are home a lot more. We're taking care of our skin more, I feel, from home. Like we can't go to our spas, we can't go to, you know, our our aestheticians, I can't ever say it, but because of that, we are taking beauty and skincare into our own hands. So the fact that we are having more and more tools to do that at home is huge and fantastic and awesome possum. So the Farmer X line has a total of four different products. So there is a cooling gel, there is the multivitamin moisturizer, which is more of a regular traditional cream. And then there's a Bacuchiol, and I like that word, Bacuchiol, Bacuchiol serum, as well as a Bacuchiol eye cream. I'm going to get into what Bacuchiol is a little bit later on. And yes, I actually did a course on this. Well, not really a course, but I took some training on this and I got my cert to share with you guys so that I so you guys know that I actually did some studying on this. No, I just like learning about it too. The claim is that this new vegan skincare collection with the natural plant-based ingredients is to help promote healthier looking skin and is safe for sensitive skin. I did look through all four of the products and it does look like it is good for sensitive skin. My, my skin has been much more reactive lately over the past few months. And so I am really excited for that because hopefully it'll help get rid of some of the beautiful... Well, actually, they've they've gone down a lot. I've I've been using the, the Isanox exfoliator, the micro needling polisher, and that has done huge things. Like my skin still feels really soft. I just got out of the shower, as you can tell, and I've done nothing on my skin except for put on toner. Uh, the toner's not Avon because Avon doesn't have a toner yet until in another two campaigns. I think it is. <laughs> I'm excited about getting a toner from Avon. Every single product I'm going to show you it is created with the slow herb complex which is a blend of botanicals that thrive in dry and stressful conditions and they're slowly cold brewed to extract all the antioxidants and all the goodies out of it for peak efficacy the results that we're supposed to get out of this is that your dry skin will feel instantly nourished so yummy and um, leaving your skin feeling fresh healthy and with a beautiful natural dewy look so that is the claim and so i'm excited to experience that upon instant application the other thing is that because it is what we call clean beauty it is derived from at least minimum 85 percent natural ingredients so that's the lowest amount of natural ingredients in all four of these products there is one that i believe has up to 92 percent, and i will showcase that in a few minutes also the other thing is it does include safe synthetic ingredients to preserve the integrity of the formula and there also is a strict blacklist banning including no parabens no phthalates mineral oils no sulfates artificial dyes fragrances or 
animal testing. Yay! The spread for this, guys, was so gorgeous. It was like so super fresh and just this whole feeling of serenity with the marketing that they made for it. Oh my gosh, I love the marketing. It's just, it's so beautiful. The other cool thing about it is that it is sustainable packaging. The, the cartons itself are responsibly sourced and certified by the FSC, which stands for the Forest Stewardship Council. Also, the materials are made from recyclable glass, which is also great. Uh, and like I said before, it is suitable for sensitive skin because it is hypoallergenic as well as dermatologist tested. As I previously mentioned, all four of the products does include the Slow Herb Complex, which is a mixture of four types of Xeric herbs, I want to say that's how you pronounce it. So the herbs are calendula, lavender, yarrow, and sage, and those are proven to help calm your skin. So I guess if you're having like an irritated flare up, it's gonna be good for that. And so xeric herbs are the herbs that, um, like I said before, they're grown in extremely stressful and dry environments. So just imagine if they can thrive in that, what it's gonna do for your skin. So as I mentioned, everything is extracted through the clue cold blooming method and so how this works as it says this method uses a solvent drop by drop to extract compounds from these herbs and by doing this it prevents damaging compounds in the herbs that may be vulnerable to heat good to know so it's not the heat's not going to damage anything and then the final extract is rich in natural antioxidants for healthy looking skin first up there is the super greens so the super greens are this size here these are each 90 ml they are freaking ginormous oh my gosh love the packaging i love how natural and zen this feels so it's like a different type of zen it's not like rice water bright zen where it's just like it's like pretty zen this looks oh natural just wellness type zen I'm not saying that rice water bright zen did not promote wellness i don't know what i'm gonna do going down a rabbit hole stop just okay anyways the key ingredients in the super green formula includes broccoli sprouts which is known to calm and relieve redness in your skin plus it is high in vitamins a b c calcium magnesium potassium dietary fibers and folic acids are we eating this then there's also a uh, brussels sprouts i'm getting hungry now like really hungry so there's brussels sprouts which is also high in dietary fibers folic acid ma magnes manganese manganese vitamin a c and e there's this phrase that says considered high in prebiotic fiber so i don't know what that means so i'm going to look that up in a second but also the brussels sprouts contains vitamins and also known to be antioxidants the other thing that has a lot of antioxidants that's included in this is green tea which is rich in polyphenols um, and also of course the antioxidants and it helps to highly moisturize your skin as well as improve your skin's ability to retain moisture finally there's also moringa oil i think i pronounced that right which is rich in uh, omega fatty acids to help protect your skin's moisture barrier um, and also helps to it helps to like balance all skin types without it feeling greasy all right, found a really cool article about it on today.com. Prebiotics apparently is good for your skin for topical use as well because it's kind of like, okay, you know how yogurt's good for your gut? So it's kind of like the same idea but for your skin because your skin has, uh, and you've probably heard about it when we talked about the new moisture therapy uh, skincare line where there is the microbiome of your skin. Skin microbiome, ref according to today.com, refers to the mix of bacteria, yeast, parasites that live on your skin and because the skin is your the human body's largest organs this mixture i'm paraphrasing a little bit here guys can't yet tell so most of this mixture of these microorganisms are actually harmless or even beneficial for your skin so like if you gut bacteria you want to have some bacteria in your gut but it needs to be good bacteria and not like the yucky stuff so it's the same idea so basically what prebiotic fibers are kind of like a fertilizer or food for the probiotics and it promotes the growth of these microorganisms in if you're eating it your gut don't eat the skin cream or um for your face or well topical not really specifically for your face they didn't say that but for your skin so i guess it helps to balance our skin flora or the the microbiome so like look at the microbiome kind of like a protective force field shield for your skin i guess that's what it is that's really cool i need to say this article to remind me every now and then that's very cool so that's from today.com i'll link that down below for you guys first off let's open up this beauty here so this is the special trial kit they are 10 mls 
for the Super Greens and then 5 mLs for the Bacuccio. When I bring them out, I'll talk about each one of these products as well as I'll do a quick little first impressions. I am going to be testing out this product for at least two weeks or until the items run out. Uh, and then if I love it, I'm going to buy the full size. I already have the full size ones here. And exciting news is that I actually won or earned another full size one um, because of all the wonderful incentives that Avon offers us. So let's open up this beauty first off. Ooh, okay. Did something fall out nothing fell out oh it's so cute so let's pull these out first look they're so cute oh my gosh this serum bottle is to die for oh my goodness gracious look at these i am slightly in love they are so cute it's almost like a toy but check this out this is my favorite bottle of all Look how adorable this is. I love this. This is insanely cute. Okay, so on each of these, they do have the expiration date on the bottom, which is good to know so that you use it as as its best potency. These are made in Korea. Let's talk about this Super Greens cooling gel. So this is the mini version and this is the large one. I thought that I ordered the full size of the Bacuccio stuff too, but I didn't. All right, but so this is the large size. I love how the green inside is green too. That's a nice touch. It's heavy. It's really heavy, guys. Look at how sleek and clean that looks. Totally glass, which is beautiful. So you apply this on clean skin after your serums and skincare treatment. If you want to use it as a leave-on mask, you want to apply a thick, even layer and let it absorb into the skin. As a moisturizer, you just apply it with a thin layer. I'm going to try it all on my hands first so you guys can see, and then we're going to go from there. What the cooling gel does, it's a hybrid cooling gel that can be used as either a moisturizer or a mask, as I already just said, but um, it's supposed to apply an instant cooling and hydrating sensation to your skin, and so it will help soothe the hydrated skin, as well as contains vitamins and nutrients to effectively and naturally support healthy looking skin. This one contains super ingredients, ingredients known to be high in minerals, vitamins A, B, C, E, fatty acids, and other key nutrients known to keep skin looking healthy and balanced. Okay, and then this one here is, of course, 86% natural. Key ingredients is that slow herb complex, um, as well as Oh, oh, aloe, bro Brussels, broccoli sprouts, Brussels sprouts, green tea, moringa oil, which are ingredients I talked about earlier. I'm going to open up the small one first, guys. All right, because this is the one I'm going to use. Hopefully, this lasts me two weeks. I think it will because I'm using, I'm going to be using the cooling gels a day cream. And if I go outside, I am going to put on an SPF um, on top of it just be, to help prevent, you know, damage from sun. And then this is the Super Greens Multivitamin Moisturizing Cream, which I will be using at night. And of course, day and night, I'll be using the serum and the eye cream. Love this. You are so cute. Oh, you know what I'll do? I'll do half my face with the cooling gel and half my face with the moisturizer my gosh the weird things that I do okay so here it is Ew. I love this color it reminds me of light Asian Jade there's no added fragrance I can barely smell anything I smell something kind of fresh but there's no perfume which is nice okay so this oh ooh, 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 it is quite cool all right let's put it on the back of my hand just watch my hand for you guys first and oh oh the glide on is like silk my friends I feel that cooling sensation. It's just kind of like an evaporation type of a feel almost. It's just like that. You know how, how you can get like one little thing wet and go. That's what I feel on the back of my hand. Absorbed really fast. Like it's already absorbed in. Wow. That is, once again, the Super Greens cooling gel that I'm going to be applying to my face later. Next up, we have the Super Greens Multivitamin Moisturizing Cream. So this is the trial size. The coloration looks a little bit different. I'm just going to assume because it is ingredients in it because it has no dyes. I feel like I'm going to really like this line. Ooh, it's so heavy. Can't get over how heavy these things are. Okay, so this is the Super Greens Multivitamin Moisturizing Cream. So this comes in the trial size. This is the full size. If the trial size ones are plastic, just so you guys know. But this is like the full glass. I really like the container. I might even save the container for something else afterwards. I don't know what, but I might. The moisturizing cream, I'm going to use this primarily as a night cream because I do like things a little bit heavier at night while I rest and just let things just kind of heal up um, or kind of like rejuvenate. 
Um, so this is a daily multivitamin cream for healthy looking skin, uh, leaving your skin moisturized and nourished. It's supposed to uh, replenish your dry skin and it contains vitamins and nutrients to effectively and naturally support healthy looking skin. It sounds like it has like a lot of the same ingredients as the super green cooling gel. Um, but this is a gel form and this is a cream form. So it's high in minerals, vitamin A, C, E, fatty acids, and other key ingredients known for natural and healthy looking skin. You can use this after serums, treatments, and your eye cream. I'm not going to do any treatments during this time, guys. No animal testing, vegan and clean. This is 98% natural. That is incredible. 98% natural, guys. Wow, that's insane. So the key ingredients include the broccoli spuds, Brussels sprouts, green tea, moringa oil, slow herb complex. Let's test it out on this side right here. Da, da, da. Here it is. Let's open this up. Ah, this one is a little different. Oh, it's much thicker. Okay, so it doesn't do that like little slight pull. Again, I smell nothing. Try it on the back of my hand. Oh, 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 this one's more buttery. I already can notice that this one takes a little bit more to to have it absorbed in my skin, probably because of the thicker consistency, but that means that it's great for nighttime. So you have more time to like just love your skin. Oh yeah, you smell a little bit. Or is that my body lotion from before? I can't tell. If there is a scent, it's so faint that I can't detect it. it feels super duper 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 nourished. I think that the, the cream is going to be more moisturizing, to be honest with you. Next, we have the Bacuccio Serum. So Bacuccio, Bacuccio, Bacuccio. I love that word. It's a Japan word. It's really cool because Bacuccio, it's a vegan alternative to retinol. And the cool thing about it is that it doesn't prom doesn't create like photosensitivity like traditional retinol does. Because if you look at some of your retinol products, you'll see on it, do not use... Um, uh, right before direct sunlight or something along those lines. So you want to use those ones um, usually, I guess, at night, like those type of retinol treatments. This one here, you can use during the day because it does not create that photosensitivity. It's also great as a... Um, as a vegan alternative for people who have sensitive skin or if they do react to retinol products. They call it a natural vegan wrinkle fighter, which is great because I would like that for here. Maybe my neck too. The Bacuccio is mainly obtained from the seeds of the plant Sorelia corylifolia. Up here for you. Can't say that at all. But the plant itself is gorgeous. It's purple, kind of blue, really, really pretty. But this is this is from the, the seed of it. Bacuccio itself, it does not contain or convert into any type of retinol, but studies have shown that Bacuccio has the same effects on your cells as retinol, and um, it's supposed to help decrease the size of aging, reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It's supposed to provide a strong antioxidant effect, smooth your skin, and help to even out your skin tone and give a calming effect. So if it's going to even out my skin tone, I expect great things. The serum itself is a lightweight oil texture. Oh, interesting, because I'm used to serums being a little bit thicker that targets fine lines, wrinkles, firmness, skin roughness, and brightening. Excellent! And it's supposed to help to reduce the looks of fine lines and wrinkles, enhance your skin's radiance, and make your skin smoother and more even toned. And the other thing is that it's 98% natural. You use this after you wash your face before any moisturizers, okay? So the key ingredients of this is the slow herb complex as well as the Bacuccio. I'm really excited about this. I wonder if it's a mini dropper. I hope it is. Oh, it is. Look at that, guys. It is the cutest, teeny, tiniest dropper in the world. Oh, my God. Okay, I need to put it down a little bit. But, oh, my gosh, I freaking love this one. So I'm just going to put a little drop here. Ooh. 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 Okay. Okay, I put one drop. Look at that. It looks like, well, oh, okay, so it's like a very light oil. So it doesn't feel like a heavy oil. And look at how much spread I got just from that one little drop, guys. Like that one drop did the entire back of my hand from the from the knuckle of my pinky all the way to my wrist. Oh, this one has a little bit of a scent to it. It smells earthy. Does that make sense? Like it doesn't smell perfumey. It has like this natural earthy scent to it. Interesting. You can still see how it's moisturized. Can you see that little bit of a shine? 
Oh, okay. I'm excited. My left hand's going to be gorgeous, guys, because I don't ever repeat the same thing on my right hand. All right, so that's the Picucho. The This one here is only 5 ml, but the, the full-size one is 30 ml, and so... Like that covered all, one drop covered this entire section. So the 30 ml will last you for quite some time. Final product. Whenever I do these videos, guys, the whole collection, they always are really long. So thank you for bearing with me. I love you guys. If you haven't yet, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up. Final thing here is the Farm RX Bacuccio Eye Cream. And so this is supposed to be a hydrating eye cream that helps with brightening and firming around the skin around the eyes while reducing the look of fine lines and wrinkles. Plus, it's supposed to instantly help with dark circles. And yes, this mama has dark circles under her eyes because of the kids. Firm the skin to help reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles in this area, which is great because I do have a little bit here. It's actually been pretty good because I have been using the Belief Moisturizing Eye Balm since December. And it's very lightweight and it's really, really, really nice. This contains Bacuccio as well as the Slow Herb Complex. Um, and this one here is 90% natural. So you apply this one after you use your serums and treatments before your moisturizers. And of course, all these products, guys, no animal testing. Retinol for your eyes. Like not for your eyes, but around your eyes. I don't know if we have any other product that has retinol for right around your eye area. So that's interesting. Oh, oh. I don't want to waste because this needs to last me two weeks. Oh, oh, it's tickling my arm here. So the texture is not as heavy and thick as the cream, which is a good thing because your skin around your eyes is a lot thinner, so you don't want to have anything too heavy. It absorbs really fast. Again, it has the same um, earthy scent as the Bacuccio serum, so I'm assuming that that is caused from the Bacuccio itself because all the products have this little herb complex and doesn't have that scent, so it has to be the Bacuccio. Oh. I'm like Enola Holmes. If you guys watch that one, guys, on Netflix, and so good, I loved it. Nelson didn't get into it as much, but I loved it. I thought she was absolutely brilliant and adorable. Are we ready to try this on my face? I am ready to try this on my face. All right, so here, I'm going to show you my face. So I washed my face almost half an hour ago now because I've been talking so much. So <laughs> my face is like, where's my moisturizer? But here's my skin. You can see I have some marks left. It's gotten so much better, like incredibly better with the polisher. I've noticed the biggest difference with the polisher in reducing the marks. And also like my nose area, I'm not getting nearly as many pimples or blocked pores because of that polisher. So I highly recommend, highly recommend that polisher yeah but overall my skin has been behaving a lot better than it was before i haven't gotten any ginormous pimples on my face which is i get i'm getting these like teeny tiny little blemishes but usually <laughs> only after i eat chips <laughs> so if you see me with bad skin it's because i caved to to my i lost willpower and ate some ate some junk so i'm looking forward to helping see that those little fine lines there. So helping with those fine lines. And then even though my skin tone will be nice. First off, going to start off with the uh, Farm RX serum because that's the first step. Again, I already used my toner. My skin feels quite soft, exfoliated right before for today. So let's try this. I love this dropper. One. Let's start with two drops and see. It's really interesting because normally I affiliate an oil as the last step of your skincare pro of your skincare regimen, but not this time. It's already feels moist, more moisturized. My skin is sucking this stuff up. I feel a light tingle, but I think it's because I waited so long. Normally, I put my my skin cream on within like seven minutes of getting out of the shower, but already just with the serum, my face feels softer. It feels like a little bit more. Plushy. Is that a word? Plushy? Like a plush top. Okay. If I'm going to do my neck too, I'd, I'd have to add a third drop. But two drops was more than enough for my face. Next, eye cream. A dab a bit on my ring finger like so. Do, do, do. I always go further out. I go into my temples. Do you guys go into your temples too? Does this side look less tired instantly? Maybe. Don't know if it had actually hit the dark circles right away, but it does feel good. All right, let's finish up this side. I know you're not supposed to go to your eyelids, but I'm old. <laughs> okay, now, this side, I'm going to do cooling gel. This side, I'm going to do moisturizing cream. 
Oh, okay. I feel that like feeling. I just have like this nice cool breeze on my face. It feels nice. This would be great for the summer, especially the fact that this has aloe. After sun, this might be something good just to take to the beach so you have it for after sun too. Final one, the moisturizing cream. I'm not gonna use my face roller right now. Glides on, it's so buttery. The moisturizer cream is much thicker. All right, here's my skin immediately afterwards. Oh. Okay, it already looks like healthier. <laughs> it looks, not, not healthier, but it looks less dry, parched. So you can feel the consistency difference. Like when you do this, this side was gonna like, ooh, easier. This side's like, uh, 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 uh. So I think makeup will sit better on the cooling gel than on this side. So far, it feels really nice. I like the cooling gel as a day cream because I th oh, wear my makeup during the day, right? For work and stuff. Um, so I do like that. The eye cream felt really nice going on. Let's put makeup on everything and see where it lasts. But I'm going to do that off camera. Makeup is now done. I did notice that overall... Um, I liked how makeup applied more with the cooling gel side than the moisturizing cream side. Um, I just felt that it was a little bit thicker on this side and I could still feel it. So I think it's going to be a beautiful, beautiful, perfect nighttime moisturizer as opposed to the uh, daytime when I want things done fast and quick so that I can get going with my day. I didn't do my lipstick very well. That's okay. So I am excited to try this out for a couple of weeks or however long the products last me for to see what a difference it does make. Hopefully it does help fade more of my acne scars and so that I can have, you know, more cleaner, radiant, dewy looking skin, which will be exciting. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you do give this video a big fat thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. If you're interested in becoming a beauty boss and doing something like this, playing with makeup, playing with skincare products, testing on new products, giving your opinion, and then earning out of it, make sure you do go to the link in the description box and then click that join Avon button so that you can get your Avon business started right away and sell from coast to coast all across Canada. If you have any questions for me before you decide whether or not to start your Avon business, make sure you do reach out to me on either Instagram or Facebook because I am here to help. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!